so what I like and what I'm having so much fun with the art store is uh, as a you know as a is a short comedy sketch uh, sitcom ish thing. I'm having fun with telling a very micro uh, story with micro storytelling essentially um, with you know minimum <laughs> minimum setup. You know, focusing basically on the super basics, beginning, middle, end. Uh, you know, a setup and punchline essentially. Um, and I'm, you know, I'm really kind of going for something that I, I just want to have fun in a way showing a short version of what maybe a late eighties or maybe mid to mid to late eighties, early nineties sitcom, uh, might look like in my hands, uh, running this type of a, uh, a story. And you know, of course I only have myself. To work with right now, um, I am open, of course, to opening to uh, working with more people, and uh, my lovely, lovely love of my life will be working with me on some um, episodes. But it's just, it's a lot of fun, and I'm just very short form storytelling. Uh, like I said, literally just you know, set up and punchline, essentially is what I'm going for, and it's different than when I do my comedy sketches. Um, those are very, of course, very set up and punchline as well, and a little bit more absurd, maybe. This one's more story arc focused, uh, following Peter, who owns the art store, who um, he is, you know, he's going through this time in life. He's always run this art store, it's a good time. And now, if you've watched the latest episode, which, which if you haven't, I'm not going to spoil it for you, but everything changes from from the third episode out. And uh, we're just going to see what happens, where he goes from here, essentially. But that's what, that's what I wanted to do with this sketch, is I wanted to make it like it's in, like a like I said, like mid to late 80s, early 90s sitcom style with the, uh, the clapping at the beginning, uh, some sound effects in there. I might add a, a laugh track or something, just for the hell of it, just to kind of give it that feel, that nostalgic feel, uh, which is what I'm going for, as well as... Just this, you know, it's a very mundane, you know, uh, situation comedy. He's in, you know, it's a retail comedy essentially, but it's something that's close to my heart, something that's close to a lot of people who I know uh, their heart as well. And uh, yeah, I'm just having a lot of fun with it.